everyone welcome back to my channel plans with amanda today we're planning in my vertical catch-all happy planner for the week of march 14th through the 20th we're going to be we've got saint patrick's day coming up we've got the first day of spring coming up so i'm excited about this week's uh spread we're going to be using the pink blooms from live love posh from the rainbow edit box set that i've been showing you guys i've used this several times not available just yet but hopefully by the time this video comes out she'll be announcing when the restocks come and I know she said it was going to be restocked in um, March sometime so hopefully that'll be soon but yeah so we're going to pull from this pink blooms book here we're going to be using these orange and pink floral stickers I love the orange in there the light pink and the dark pink I think they'll be really cute I'm also going to be pulling in some Mambi sticks and I'm going to put uh, hello spring on here in the Mambi sticks and I'm going to either use the black hello with the spring or the small golden uh, foil hello. And I'm not sure yet. I'm gonna kinda see how the spread comes together, but that's my idea so far. That's all I've got really. <laughs> Other than that, I don't really have a plan for how I'll lay everything out. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and get started. Get all that out of the way. All right, so <clears throat> I know I want to put the spring here, okay? And we'll hold on to the Hello stickers for now. Like I said, I'm not sure yet on that, so we'll hold on to those. And I do have some washi tape too, so I'm gonna go ahead and hold that out um, because the pink is just perfect for these stickers and it also has gold polka dots on it. It's kind of a shiny washi tape. I got this from Walmart, I think, in one of those little four packs. Uh, four or five packs that you can get the get in the stationary aisle, but um, but it still tears even though it's kind of got a shimmer or excuse me a shiny layer on top. So anyway, it's not my favorite to have that shiny layer, but the the washi tape is cute, so I think I want to use it. Um, so anyway, like I said, we're gonna put this here. I'm not sure about the hello part yet. We'll get to that. But before I stick this down, I think I want to go ahead and start putting some florals down just to kind of set a uh, kind of set a layout, a look, you know, to get us going here. We'll see what we can do here. Um, I <clears throat> excuse me. I haven't decided on whether or not I want to pull in color boxes or black boxes. I think that the black boxes would be really cute, but to keep it real springy and light and colorful, I'm thinking of colored boxes. But we'll figure that out too as we get there. Um, so I think I want to go ahead and pull in these corner florals here I think we're gonna go ahead and put them right up here on Monday and I don't think I'm gonna do any whiting out today I, I always say that and then I do it anyway I used to not white out at all and then well I kind of quit whiting out and then so now I'm kind of getting tired of it again, and so I kind of go back and forth. But yeah, I think I'm just going to do um, no white out today, so that'll help things move a little quicker, hopefully. All right, so if that is, oh my gosh, that is so pretty. I love, I love that. That's probably one of my favorite stickers I've ever used from one of these uh, small shop books. Hmm, so cute. Okay, so I kind of need to know pretty quick what color boxes I'm using. So let me get those pulled out. So we have Mojo Jojo Plans black boxes. We have the pink boxes that came in here. Um, I could mix it up. I could do black and some of the pinks and maybe find an orange. I don't know if I have a, an orange that bright. Let me see what's in the, the Orange Blooms book. That's kind of that color, but it's a little bit darker. That's a little bit lighter. I don't know if I want to go that dark. Hmm, we'll hold on to those. I, I don't know about that yet. Okay, let me see if I have an orange box. I'll be right back. So I found some orange boxes that I think will work really well in the Mojo Jojo Plans spring boxes. And so we're gonna probably pull some of those in. I think I like the idea of going with the black, pink, and the orange. So we'll probably do that. The next thing I'm gonna do is 
figure out my arrangement on these letters um, so I can make a decision on where I'm putting the florals at next. And my, I, I can fit them, if I squeeze them in really close, I can fit it on here. I've tried that already. But before we do that, I wanna see if maybe I can do something a little bit more fun with them. I'll be honest, I'm not real big on crooked letters. Um, I think I'm, I'm more of a, I like them straight more, you know, because to me that does kind of looks funny. Yeah, I don't like that. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna make them straight. Um, okay, let's go ahead and pull in some more florals and we'll we'll figure it out. I think this would be cute up here. I may trim the edge to make it have a, a flat edge at the top. We'll, we'll wait just a minute on that. I'm not sure if I want to do that yet. And let me go ahead and add in a box or two for Sunday and Saturday because I don't want to run out of room for that. Cute. I need to figure out, I guess I could pull in both pink colors because we've got light and dark, so we'll see on that. Maybe pull in a small orange one. That's cute. Okay, uh, I may trim that. I'm not sure yet. Let's go ahead and put spring down. We'll get it in place. what I want to do is put a line of washi tape underneath this um, if I find my washi tape I had set aside here it is um, not this washi tape this I'm going to decorate with but I think I'm going to just take a small strip to so that I can line it up really straight without having to stress it let me just see if I can find a this one I don't use much of straight. Sometimes I cheat and I'll get my ruler out to see. It's kind of going uphill. All right, we've got it. Okay, so now I have a little line to guide me on where to stick the letters and I don't have to stress over them going up or downhill. So we'll go go ahead and get these on here. All right, so I know I'm gonna have to tuck my letters up into the disc just a little bit. Um, like I said, I tried this out earlier, so hopefully I can get this to work on the first time around. 
I won't press them all down super hard until I get them uh, lined up. Maybe they'll, and that maybe they won't be too too bad. <laughs> Okay, so I can space them out just a little bit because I have them pretty close together. So let me do that. They're a little bit closer than I wanted them. is thinking it looking good okay yeah I think that looks good okay so let's go ahead and press them down and then I can take the blue washi up without tearing it there we go very cute okay so I have to make room for hello I need to make sure to leave enough room for whichever one I decide if I'm using the black Hello Spring. And I kind of wanted to just get the layout kind of going before I decided. Oh my gosh, that's so cute though. And I've also got the little gold, which is also really cute, especially if I'm using this washi tape with the gold polka dots. Hmm. I think I like the black, but we're still gonna hang on just a second on that. Let's go ahead and get some washi tape in so we can see mm, I not really like it right there with the spring kind of takes away from it I'm not sure if I like it at all you guys I know I'm, I change my mind all the time on washi tape but I just don't I like the look of it, but the shininess and then, I don't know, we're going to hang on to it. We'll hang on to it. I still like the black hello, I think. We may go ahead and stick that down here in a minute. But let's keep going with some boxes and then we'll make a decision. Alright, so I know I need a box on Monday. And if I'm doing a long box, I need to put that on here. I think maybe a black one on that. Just trying to figure out if I want to do one with lines or without. Let's see what this one would look like. We have some quotes too, so let's hold on to this. And I'm, I've got to get some of this stuff out of my way, y'all. <laughs> Just, I've got a mess over here. Let me go ahead and pull out some boxes from the books just so I can have them so I'm not flipping around in the book so much. I also have this really light pink long box sticker that I think might be really pretty. I'm 
to look at that one real quick and see. Let's just flip it around. Hmm, I don't know, that's kind of, that one doesn't really do a whole lot for it. So, like I said, we have um, I have an appointment on Monday, so let's put that down. Um, St. Patrick's Day, I believe, is the 17th. Let's go ahead and stick this down. Definitely know we're doing this. I tried to stick them together so that I would just have to peel off just the one thing. All right. That's so cute. Okay. Let's, we need some more florals on this page. But I've done made, I might have just, I've done messed myself up, I think. Um, let's go ahead and do this smaller box sticker on Friday. It'll be fine. I can write around it if I need to. And Thursday is St. Patrick's Day, so I'm going to leave that kind of open because I'm going to pull in some clovers and something for that. Let's go ahead and do the black long box over here. Very good. All right, so I pulled Amber Plans Her Day holiday quotes in boxes and black quotes because she's got some cute spring quotes and she's got some, so here's the spring ones. And she's also got some St. Patrick's Day ones, so I'm not sure what we wanna pull in. We'll hold those to the side. They, there's some cute ones here and they're kind of small, so that works. So we'll probably pull one of those in for St. Patrick's Day. I'm thinking a quote up here because I've got all these florals here. So I really don't need a whole lot of color here. I just need something. Let's see if this one will fit. The first blooms of spring always make my heart sing. That's cute, but I'm second guessing the black box. But we're gonna go ahead and stick it down and we can always change the box out. That's pretty straight. I think it's all right. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and pull my wax paper back out and pick out a couple of other quotes. Maybe just one other quote because we've got this big quote here technically, but I, th I love her font and I wanna bring it in just to kinda, um, so I like this one. And I'm gonna pick a couple of them because I, that way, depending on where I need it, I can, I can use it. If whatever I don't use, I'll just put back. We've got spring is in the air, and those two talk about blooming, and this one does too. So we're gonna hold off on those. Okay, I think I'm gonna hold those two out just to see what we can come up with here. Let's work on St. Patrick's Day just a little bit to kind of get a feel for that. Um, I pulled the Happy Planner Mega Seasonal Book because there's some cute St. Patrick's Day stuff in here. I think it was on this side. Yeah, here we go. Um, so I think I want to pull some of these 
clovers, and I think there was another one back here I liked. If it will go. A St. Patrick's Day with a little gold um, pot of gold. Okay. So maybe I'll take this whole block here and maybe make a St. Patrick's Day theme. Maybe a black box. I had a, I had a St. Patrick's Day phrase. Here it is. It's in the holiday quotes and boxes. Okay, um, let's go ahead and pull a few clovers in. And maybe a black box. Here's, here's one. I'm thinking about, I'm trying something different here, y'all. If I can make it work. I cut that kind of crooked, but that's okay. I can move that sticker. So I was just thinking about maybe just trying to fill in this box here to make it um, festive for the holiday, but not have such a, I don't want it to just, that was a little bit too bold. So let's see if we can work this in here and in a way that kind of is cohesive with the spread. That's looking cute. We don't usually have plans on St. Patrick's Day, so it's probably fine that it just takes up that whole box there. And, um, yeah, I like that. Because these greens um, match the green in the florals pretty well, so I think that's really cute. I'm gonna hold off on that sticker I just don't think it goes really well with it. Okay, we will hold off on the, the clovers for now. I think I messed my line up, that's okay. All right, let's get that out of the way. Okay, this side's looking really good. We, got, we need to work on this side a little bit more. Um, so my first thought with this black was that this didn't have any color, so we'll, we'll hold that thought in our mind that we might need to bring some color in there. 
<clears throat> I've already I've also got some checklist stickers in this uh, Live Love Posh book too that I might want to bring in. Let's put this on Monday. And probably need to bring in some more florals. I feel like I'm kind of back and forth really spastic on this spread, but <laughs> I don't know, that's just how I plan. I go back and forth. I don't do all of one thing first and then do something else, but some people do, I'm sure, but. I'm second guessing these boxes. And this one's gonna be tough. could get out the undo, but I don't want to. Okay. I'm going to pull this sticker in. It kind of matches that one. I'm going to pull it in down here. I've got it a little too far over. Let me see if I can get that repositioned. That's better. Okay, so we're gonna pull our boxes in. I, I took them all off because they were not, it just wasn't working for me. So I wanted to kind of redo, re, start over a little bit. All right, so box on Wednesday. That's cute. Um, that's looking good. I'm liking that. Need to figure out. I might not have left myself enough room for a header here, but we'll figure it. We may move those up just a little bit. Um, need to figure out my quotes. We've got spring is in the air and spring makes life pretty. I think that's really cute right there, but I don't know. I don't like how they're so close to each other up here, but if I pull this one in over here, I think that might be okay. So. I don't have to have another box sticker on Sunday because I've got one up here. I don't want to add anything right there because I don't want to take away from St. Patrick's Day. And I don't want to add this up here because it's too close to that. The only place on this page I have room for it is down here if I want to take that box off. Let's see. Okay. I'll try not to tear up my sticker. And I did okay. <laughs> okay, let's see what we have with these two. I like this here, but I'm gonna move this box over. That's better. So we can figure out, do we want to pull in the, the flower with it? 
maybe kind of like that. That's cute. All right, we're making progress. Okay, so that means we want to put this here. All right, so cute. Okay, do we need anything else? Let me check my word stickers for my headers here, maybe here. Figure out if I'm putting any color on this sidebar, and then we'll be done. I thought we could add this other little pink flower over here. Would add a little color to the sidebar. I think that's cute. Yeah, I like that. All right, what else do we have here? I think I need some more light pink mixed in because I only have those two and I only have one dark pink box, so maybe if I add some smaller pinks in, that'll help bring them to get, bring the two pages together a little bit better. Um, let's see what we have here. That's better. I was looking for my mega book that has the handwritten plans in it because they, they're all clear, but I couldn't find it. So I'm gonna look through here and see if I can find something to put on top of that sidebar sticker. I actually like using that for a grocery list. That's what I've been doing late, lately. Those are in here somewhere. There it is. So we'll use that one here. And then something here. I saw, um, well, actually, you know what? I have in this Planner Basics, I think there's a little sticker sheet of maybe chores. where I saw that not too long ago. Here it is. What about like that? I saw this cute little game time sticker. I pulled it. It's got the pink font which goes really well with this spread and Friday night plan our Friday night plans are actually a game night at some friends house so we're going to use this sticker I'm going to trim the bottom just a little bit here and put it right above our box sticker that's cute and I think I have I think I want to pull in one more floral and I want to squeeze it in right here. <laughs> I don't know. I just, well, very cute. I love it. All right, guys, that's our spread. Let's put it in the planner. Let's see what it's going to look like. If you missed this spread, it's on my channel from last week. 
Amber Plans Her Day Spring Collection sticker book with the tulips. I really liked how that one turned out too. All right, guys, here we got it. We got March 14th through the 20th in my Catch All Happy Planner using Live Love Posh Pink Bloom stickers along with Amber Plans Her Day quotes and some Mambi sticks here. I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll see you next time. Bye.